Hello and welcome back everyone. So I hope you all are doing great. So what am I talking today about? I'm talking about, um, I think most of us are able to achieve it, but sometimes we fail to understand why we are not able to achieve our goals. So today, this is what I'll be talking about, where you need to work the most. And I will also be sharing my five techniques which are shared with my clients and they have seen so many success. So remember that you have to work in a way that it is scientifically proven, right? So we cannot do things like, I would say, uninformed. So a good information is always a better way to work with the people. So you would ask me, what are we talking all about today? So the question that you have asked me the answer to that is we'll be talking about the science behind just one word, focus, five minutes, right? So focus could be the key to turning your dreams into reality. Yes, it's as simple as that. But how do you harness the power of just focus? So we'll talk all about it. So as you know, I come here on the week basis to some of my experiences and the things which I've shared with my clients and their seen successes. I hope you all watch me here and get something out of it, start to find it right away and start to see the results. And also, uh, please to subscribe to my channel. Please also share this video who might need to hear this and comment something what you want to see, what you want me to take a topic on as a life coach. And with that, let's get started. So what are we talking today? We're talking about all about focus. So one thing you need to achieve all your goals is the focus. Do we have one? Yes, we do, but it's somewhere back there, but we need to work on it every single day, right? So first of all, uh, the science for this one neurotransmitter who's responsible for focus. Now you really need to understand why you are not able to focus or concentrate on things. So there's always a science behind that, why you are facing these situations. So there is one neurotransmitter which is responsible for that. Now you would ask me, what is neurotransmitter? Neurotransmitter is nothing is a chemical substance that is released at the end of the nerve fiber by the arrival of a nerve impulse by diffusing across the synapses or the junction. Right, so the information between two neurons or two brain cells are literally uh, from one place or to another place transported through this junction called synapses. And neurotransmitters are the ones which are usually released at the end of that nerve fiber or the neuron. So what neurotransmitter puts brain in focus? So simple, straightforward. No, uh, <laughs> no additional things where you get confused. So there's what neurotransmitter you need to work on today. So the answer is dopamine. Dopamine plays a role in the body's reward system, which includes feeling pleasure, achieving heightened arousal, and learning. Dopamine also helps in focus, concentration, memory, sleep, and all those things. So it is a very important one, right? So we understood that the dopamine is responsible for the motivation, for focus, for learning, and uh, for your achieving your goals and dreams. Now what happens when the dopamine is on the lower side in your body, or it is deficient? So what you would have, you would have procrastination is one of the symptoms. You would have low self-esteem, lack of motivation. You will feel low energy and inability to focus on anything. So and always feeling anxious and feeling hope uh, listeners and mood swings. Now, how you can increase your dopamine? Let's talk all about that. So one of the things which are very simple to do, but a lot of people forget to do it is making a to-do list every day. It's so simple. Just write three things what you're going to be doing it today as a task, right? That's the simplest way. Other thing is you can always go create something, you know, through your creative juices. I'll talk all about in details. Writing could be one of them. Music could be one of them. Um, meditation, if you choose to do, it could be one of them. So the five techniques which I would have uh, seen the results with literally, I'll be discussing with you all, right? So these are the five tips or the techniques uh, backed by the science can help you 
to stay focused and achieve your goals. So number one is set a clear goal. Always have a clear clarity with your goals, what you really want to achieve. For instance, uh, like if you want to do something, finish a project by so and so date. So just put a start date and a date. That's one of the things I really do to on my clients as well. Number two is eliminate distractions, whether it's your phone, social media, or nosy environment. So try to remove them all while you're working with your goals, right? Number three is all about practice mindfulness. By staying in the present moment, you can improve your focus and productivity. So one of the uh, things which I give it to my clients as well, and they've seen the results, is just either if you can meditate for a while that's good but if you cannot just try anything which brings back your focus to the present moment right so you can see any of those techniques on youtube which you know on my videos which i've applied and to so many people and they have seen great results right technique number four is just take some breaks you know like in the morning when i was starting to do this video i personally what i do every two hours i just get up and do something or probably go to the kitchen uh, drink a glass of water that's what i personally do because that gives you breaks and that keeps your productivity high right so just do take short breaks and the last one is visualize success yes if you haven't just visualize like uh, for me i'm visualizing right now a lot of people are watching this video and they're getting so much of benefit from this video and they're commenting below thank you for doing this video this was very helpful things of that nature so start visualizing things when you're doing something and you're trying to achieve your goals right so that really really help so by incorporating these techniques into your daily routine you can enhance your focus and these are all backed by science so I can assure you that you will start to see results right away so with that I hope you are able to understand what the basic behind why you're not able to achieve your focus try this uh, techniques also work on your dopamine levels and you'll be all good to go to achieve your goals thank you for watching me and you all have a wonderful day